Adding website links to profiles is a relatively standard feature across many social media platforms, but it has strangely been absent on the TikTok platform up until this point. TikTok is now letting users to add links in their bio on their profile page, which can now direct viewers to shopping sites or any other link destination. It now offers an opportunity for anyone to drive traffic from the TikTok platform, which means more online marketers will be encouraged to sign up to TikTok and start using it as a marketing tool. In this video, I'm quickly going to show you how to add links to your TikTok account. Hi, I'm Winston the Solopreneur Warrior and in this video, I'm going to show you how to add clickable links to your TikTok profile page. But before we get into all that, if this is your first time to this channel and you are interested in video marketing as an affiliate beginner, make sure to hit that subscribe button and let's get started. TikTok rose to popularity towards the end of 2018, I think, and has remained a top app in the Android and iOS app stores. Now, many users have been wondering if they can use TikTok to post links to other sites as a way of promoting their online businesses. You have to keep in mind that although TikTok has accumulated more than a billion users worldwide, many creators and influencers currently don't find the platform as profitable as YouTube for example, where video creators can make ads revenue from their video posts. Which is why gradually TikTok has started getting it right with the updated ability to add clickable links in the bio page. Now, by default, as you can see on the profile page here, the only option to link out of the TikTok platform is by adding your YouTube or Instagram account. There is no other way to add a clickable link. So how do you go about adding a clickable link on your TikTok profile page? Well. Open up the TikTok app on your device and first you want to make sure the TikTok app you are using is updated. You need to have the latest updated version if you want this to work for you. As you can see, the latest updated version is 16.6.43. That's the latest version. Now, to know what version is installed in your device, simply tap on this three dots here at the top right and that will now lead you to the settings and privacy page. Below the page, you'll find the current version that you're using. As you can see, I'm using the updated version. So if you don't have this updated version yet, make sure to update the app or simply reinstall it from the Google Play Store. When you are sure you have the updated version, you want to go back to your account's profile page and tap on the three dots again. But this time, you want to switch your account to a business account by tapping on the first option here where it says manage your account. Below the account management page, tap on switch to pro account and then on the next page, select the business option. Then you want to select the category of your business and finish it up by hitting the next red button below. Now you want to go back to the profile page and tap on edit profile button and now you'll be provided with an option to add a website link. Tap on it and add your link. Hit the save link on the top right and your link will be added below your profile page. Now when you go back to the profile page and click on the link, it will take you to the web page you added. So there you have it, that's how easy it is to add clickable links to your TikTok profile page. Actually at the moment there are no requirements needed to add clickable links to your TikTok profile page except to switch it to a business account. Now if you are new to TikTok and you don't know what type of content to create on TikTok to drive traffic to your online business, then I will recommend you to check out Videotik. Videotik is a tool that will help you copy the same system that other marketers are following to get free traffic from TikTok but only without making a fool out of yourself. With this tool, you can schedule years worth of TikTok videos using the scheduling feature. You can easily create videos with this tool without being on camera and it works well in any language, country or niche. Just check out the complete demo of the video tick in action. All right, so this user called the business kid on TikTok has 124,000 followers, half almost half a million likes and all he posts is, you know, simple videos of whiteboard, no face videos and he just teaches uh, investing and that's what 
I'm going to show you how you can create videos just like these without actually spending time shooting videos and get hundreds and thousands of followers, sell your products, sell affiliate products, sell your services, or transfer, send these people, send your followers to any link. So I'm logged into my video tick account right over here. Now there are three kinds of videos that you can create code videos and GIF videos, which are complimentary entertaining viral videos that you can add in between. But viral video is the trick. So what we're going to do is I'm going to click on viral video and I'm going to show you how you can create a video for your TikTok in less than five minutes. So let's say my niche is investing. I'm trying to sell an ebook about investing. So I'm going to create a video for investing. I'm going to give it a title investing video for TikTok one. All right, that's my first video. My keyword is investing. I'm gonna type my keyword investing. How many slides I want? I want one slide for now, okay. I'm gonna click on next. Now what this is gonna do, is gonna go to YouTube and other video sources and find a viral trending video about investing. Now, once it does that, it I can clip uh, and trim that video and create my own video out of it. So let's click on this slide right here. I'm going to find the segment that I want to show in my TikTok video. Let's play this and let me quickly find a segment I want to show. So I want to talk about speculative assets and this guy talks about them right over here. That's me that. All right. So he starts talking about at zero six uh, seconds. So I'm going to start my video at zero five and I'm going to keep my video for 15 seconds. So uh, at 20 mark. So five till 20 is a 15 second video. Now, next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go here and type, right? I'm going to put it up top so it's visible. I'm going to add this real quick, change some color. That's all I'm going to do. Now, I can add more videos. I can add more clips, make it a longer video, but I'm just going to show you how it works. This is where I can add my logo if I want. I can add my watermark if I want. I can position them wherever I want. I want to do that. I want to just quickly create a video that I can post on TikTok tomorrow. Now, if the video that I'm posting doesn't have a audio, I can add a background music, or if I want to change the audio in that video, I can, you know, write my own uh, audio and uh, write my own script. And video tech is just going to convert that into speech using AI. And there are so many languages you can pick from. Now I'm going to click on next. I'll just create it as 720p video. I'm going to click on start creating videos in about two to three minutes, this video is going to be ready. All right, so it literally took us two minutes for the video to be ready. It's successful, done. I'm going to go to trim reel and convert it into a TikTok friendly video. I'm going to click on import video from the cloud. To find my video. This is the video that I created. So I'm going to click on use this video. Perfect. So this is the video. What I'm going to do is I'm going to click on nine to 16. This is the kind of video that, you know, TikTok allows. Now I can leave it the way it is. I can drag and drop, move it, customize it the way I want. But I'm going to go to videos over here and I'm click on no crop. So it shows up like this. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to text and I'm going to write some text saying and I'm going to position this right over here in section, change the font. And that's about it. That's all. I'm going to click on scroll up, click on create. Now what's going to happen is it's going to convert this video that I just created using the viral video section and convert this into a vertical video. It's going to take another minute to render this video. But once this video is ready, all I have to do is go to scheduler over here and schedule my video to be published on TikTok. Now let me show you how I'm going to do that. I'm just going to pick a random video that I created in past, but Let's say I want to post this video tomorrow, which is Monday 25th. I'm going to click on add post. This is the video that I just created. Okay. So I'm going to click on this video. It's selected. Scroll down, click on next. Three hashtags are more than sufficient. If you have the TikTok video take uh, pro version, the unlimited version, you can post it on Instagram as well. But I'm going to click on uh, TikTok, click next. I want it to be published at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Let me find Eastern Standard Time right here. I'm going to click on Schedule. Bam, that's it. That's all. Tomorrow at 10 a.m. Eastern, I'm just going to get a notification on my mobile phone where I have installed the uh, Video Tick mobile app. All I have to do is tap on that notification and the video will be published 
on TikTok. So it literally takes you five minutes to create one video and schedule it for TikTok. Now, imagine if you spend one hour today and take a five minute break after creating every video. So you will be able to create, um, what, six videos? Yeah, about six, five, six videos, right? In one hour, you have six videos created. Now, if you do this for, you know, a week, you can schedule, you can create fresh new content for you for the entire month, right? And schedule it to be published on TikTok on autopilot and sell your PDF ebook, get opt-ins, uh, you know, build a list, promote your product, sell your e-com stuff, whatever. And uh, all of it is done without you being on camera. It's that easy. Now, I don't think you want to miss the boat on this one like many people did with Instagram and Facebook in the early days. I will drop the link to the video tick software below this video if you are interested to check it out. And with that, I'll call this video a wrap. I hope it helps get you free traffic to whatever you are promoting online. And if you think it was helpful, hit the like button below, share on your preferred social site and don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss another helpful video. Thank mm -hmm. you.